Hi everybody, it's Miss Jane. Nice to see you today. Today I'm going to read a story called Stop Snoring Bernard. But let's get ready. Let's sit, take a breath, let it go, and then let's go criss-cross applesauce. Criss-cross applesauce. Pepperoni pizza. One more time. Criss-cross applesauce. Criss-cross applesauce. Pepperoni pizza. Okay. Stop snoring, Bernard. This is a story about an otter who snores very, very loudly. And it bothers a lot of people. A lot, bothers a lot of his friends. Let's find out. Well, this is where Bernard lives. He lives in the zoo. And there's monkeys in the tree over here. I see some tigers over here. And of course, the balloon man is selling everyone balloons. And right over here, I see Bernard laying on a towel, just relaxing. And there's his two friends swimming. Okay. Bernard loved living in the zoo. He loved mealtimes and playtime. But most of all, you needy? Most of all, he liked nap time. See him right there with his friends holding his hands? So they're all sleeping. See how they sleep on their backs? They're all sleeping. But there was one little problem. Um, Bernard s snored very loudly. <coughs> very loudly. And it bothered the people. See that face? He doesn't like that. One afternoon at nap time, Grumpy Gills had a nap. Snore somewhere else, Bernard. Snore somewhere else. So Bernard got up, got up and went to the lake. And he was snoring. And he was bothering a crocodile. And the crocodile said, Stop snoring, Bernard. So Bernard got up. And he went to lay in the fountain. And he was snoring, of course. Snore. But that didn't work either. Because he was bothering the giraffes. And they said, stop snoring, Bernard. Stop snoring. So Bernard went to sleep in a puddle. Right there. But he kept snoring. He was so loud, he bothered the baby elephant. Stop snoring, Bernard, she said. And look, the mommy elephant sprayed some water on poor Bernard. So Bernard went to find another place to sleep. <gasps> Bernard was sad and lonely. He found a tuck-away place, curled up by himself, and drifted off to sleep. But he was still snoring very loud. I wonder where he is. What does that look like to you? The other otters missed Bernard. They searched for him all through the night. They missed him. They kept saying, Bernard, Bernard, Bernard. But they didn't find him. The next morning, Bernard woke up and saw hundreds of bats. He was in a bat cave. Hundreds of bats. Excuse me, he said. How did you sleep with my snoring? We didn't, replied the bat. We were out all night, and now we are trying to sleep. So please don't snore anymore. So now Bernard had to leave the bat cave. He was very sad. Ooh. Bernard felt terrible. There wasn't any place he could sleep without bothering somebody. He trudged towards the zoo gate. There's the zoo gate right there. He's walking towards the zoo gate. He was going to leave. Then he heard something. It was his friends. They found him. It was the other otters. We couldn't sleep without you, said Grumpy Gills. And I'm sorry I yelled. Oh, please, oh, please come back. I'm sorry I yelled at you, Bernard. And from that day on, everyone napped happily. 
Well, almost everybody. If you can see Grumpy Gills, he still he has his paws on his ears. Oh. But he didn't say stop snoring. No, no, no. What he said was, good night, Bernard. Good night. The end. Okay, one song before we go. We're going to do row, 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 but we're going to do it slow, low, medium, a little bit, and then fast as we can. Okay, ready? Row, row, row the ripple, gently down the stream, merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Now a little bit faster. Row, row, row your boat, gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Now as fast as you can go, are you ready? Are you ready? <gasps> row, row, row your boat, gently down the stream, merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Oh, so tired. That was fast rolling. You all did a great job. See you next time. Bye.